four Germans. United States making her way to the ring from Scottsdale, Arizona. Bree. Bree Bella, a, a champion, blazer in the women's revolution. She's got two hit television shows. Bree Bella, a billboard example of breaking the glass ceiling and pursuing all of your dreams. Am I the only one that has the fact that most of Brie Bella's success can be attributed to the fact that she's got an identical twin and they cheat all the time? NXT gets to live once again! And her opponent, from Elmwood Park, New Jersey, Liv Morgan! The firecracker of the Riot Squad. One of the only good things to have. Oh, yeah. Come on, negotiations have broken down, and we now have to, a war on our hands. Yeah, they couldn't wait to get a hold of each other. If you ask me, guys, matches like this where there are essentially no rules are one giant free-for-all where absolutely anything can happen. this match, Byron. It's one giant free-for-all. And while it's exciting to watch, it's absolute torture on these superstars. It is, Cole. And unfortunately, matches like this usually result in injury. Sometimes serious injury. Uh-oh. Outrageous athleticism on the Hurricanrana. Brie Bella's not looking good here. Here's what we're going to see what she's made of. Man. Pump the brakes a bit, Cole. I know exactly what you're thinking. Now that got those shoulders on the mat. And Brie Bella getting the shoulder up. Gonna take a whole lot more. In matches like this, guys, you learn very quickly which superstars have what it takes to truly get extreme. Regarding Corey's point about superstars having what it takes to get extreme, I would argue that every superstar in the locker room possesses a mean streak. Yeah, but not all mean streaks are created equal, Michael. But I'd say there's only a select few who can turn their mean streaks all the way up to the most extreme level. Whoa, Brie Bella able to avoid damage. There it is. Did you hear that crack? There it is. Did you hear that crack? Oh, man. Brie Bella 
Taking a page out of the Daniel Bryan play. That'll rock him. It, is that it? Is it over? Look at this, guys. And anything goes in this one. your neck she's got something in mind the yes lock is in wow. the yes lock is in unreal yes lock what a maneuver she dodges that one Wow, Brie looks to be in some trouble that seems to be when she becomes her most resourceful She's got her. Now with complete control. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. She's in control. Severe damage being inflicted to the back. She's in full control now. Uh-oh. Things have gotten worse for Liv Morgan. She could be out of this match. This might just be the end of the road for her here, guys. Well, to be honest, she's looked overmatched for the majority of this match. Real quick reminder, guys, there are no disqualifications and no countouts in this one. Anything is legal. Oh, and there are enough weapons under the ring to fill an armory. Boom! <laughs> she is on fire! Oh, nasty impact. Boy, these superstars have been through it all here in this Extreme Rules match. Oh, so ruthless. Now that's how you use a table to your advantage. This Extreme Rules match is about to get more extreme. Yeah, you're not kidding either. I think she's trying to prove a point here. Guys, you never know what you're going to see in a match like this. And if you need proof of that, just go back to watch Dan. Here it is! And just barely got out of the way. Just wearing down the opponent. Warm up the bus. This one is over. As Corey mentioned, Daniel Bryan versus Kane from 2014. Look at that. She escapes. Talk about coming up clutch, guys. She's out of it, guys. Yeah, she's leaving herself wide open here. As we've seen in the past, really working over the body. Got every ounce of that one. This could be over. Another amazing singles contest. These two never cease to entertain the WWE Universe. I'd have to agree with what Byron's saying. When you've got action taking place all over the arena, complete with every weapon imaginable, it's not easy to keep up. Well, try, Cole. That's what you're getting paid for, isn't it? When it comes to matches like this, I'd say the more innovative a superstar is when it comes to offense, the better chance they have of victory.
This crowd has literally been on the edge of their seats ever since this title match kicked off. You gotta believe this one's over. As Byron mentioned, innovation certainly is a key in a match like this. A competitor can't be adverse to taking action outside the ring. By no means is this your traditional contest. No, it's not, Cole, but at the same time, you still win this match the old-fashioned way by pinfall or submission. Oh, so ruthless. Now that's how you use a table to your advantage. You're gonna take a trip, gentlemen. Straight down. Oh, what impact. That's all she wrote, fellas. Second time? Sure, why not? Shoulders on the back. One, two. She might just be running on instinct at this point. She just will not go away. Head scissors applied. Oh, oh, look at this. I'll tell you, watching Extreme Rules matches make me happy. My in-ring days are behind me. Look at this, Byron. She's almost out of it. Amazing. Amazingly, she works her way free. Cole, there may be no beating her here tonight. Liv Morgan just barely got out of the way. This is a treacherous match indeed, as Corey was saying. I can't even tell you how many times we've seen Extreme Rules matches result in broken bones, stitches, and even trips to a medical facility. Yeah, but despite all those inherent dangers, these superstars still willingly sign up for Extreme Rules matches. That's what amazes me the most. It escapes trouble there. She goes for the cover. Dug down deep and gets the shoulder up. I'm impressed. And what a reversal from Brie Bella. Boom. The leg drop. Oh, what a shot. Yeah, she doesn't want to take too many more of those. Look at her go. As Byron mentioned, Lesnar's attack on Cena in 2012 was without question gruesome. And furthermore, I don't think I've ever seen... Brie Bella has got her opponent in perfect positioning here. Oh, and a running knee. That should do it. Wow! Oh, man, she's rolling now. She reverses out of it, and not a second too soon. Close call there. Without a doubt, this is a volatile situation, guys. Don't any WWE superstars are dangerous without weapons. Then you put them in an environment like this, and who knows what you're liable to see. Great one-on-one -on -one action here tonight. It doesn't get much better than this. Hard to argue Michael's point on volatility and the volatility of this match, but what I think oftentimes gets overlooked is the mental anguish that goes along with competing in a match like this. No, oh, boo-hoo, cry me a river, Saxton. These competitors knew exactly what they were getting themselves into when they chose this profession. This might be it! Oh my, she is on fire! Whack! Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. Oh, what impact! Whack! Michael, that gives new meaning to have...
See, Liv Morgan just bit whack. Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. Back now inside the ring. The shoulders are down. One, two. I thought that was it. Too soon. Oh, Brie Bella able to avoid damage. When it comes to matches like this, I'd say the more innovative a superstar is when it comes to offense, the better chance they have of victory. Back between the ropes. As Byron mentioned, innovation certainly is a key in a match like this. A competitor can't be adverse to taking action outside the ring. By no means is this your traditional contest. No, it's not, Cole, but at the same time, you still win this match the old-fashioned way by pinfall or submission. She's in control. Harsh impact. She's in full control now. Big move coming. Look at that at a second time. There it is, it's locked in. Smart maneuver. This one's over, guys. This isn't good. I don't think Brie Bella knows where she is. Without a doubt, this is a volatile situation, guys. WWE superstars are dangerous without weapons. Then you put them in an environment like this, and who knows what you're liable to see. She works her way out of that one. She's still got a bit of an uphill. She counters before it's too late. Look at the look in her eyes. She's in the zone now. Looks like setting up for a suplex. Looking to finish things off. Hard to argue Michael's point on Oh my God. Some good technique right there. Larian. Oh, and the ladder finds the mark. Gonna be tough to bounce back from that one. As we've seen in the past, Extreme Rules matches create a type of hysteria that's difficult to describe, but even more difficult to contain. Three can't be stopped right now. This is the title match we've all been waiting for, guys, and so far it's delivered the goods. I'd have to agree with what Byron's saying. When you've got action taking place all over the arena, complete with every weapon. Here comes Bree. Oh, those kicks look familiar. Yeah, don't they? The yes kicks from Bree Bella. Don't leave a mark permanently. Game, set, match. This one is over. Nobody strings together a series of moves better, Cole. In matches like this, guys, you learn very quickly which superstars have what it takes to truly get extreme. Oh, and the ladder finds the mark. Gonna be tough to bounce back from that one. We're looking at complete domination here. 
Regarding Corey's point, we have seen her here before. Oh, it's locked in. You gotta think that that will end Bree's night here. Bodies are not supposed to bend that way. Some might say that it wasn't a wise move for this superstar to step inside the ring with an injury, but I don't know. It's not like it's a major... She's out! She escapes the hold. Just when it looked like her night was over, too. And she's knocked off her feet. I think that one caught her by surprise, Michael. If you ask me, guys, matches like this where there are essentially no rules are one giant free-for-all where absolutely anything can happen. She's a live wire when she's plugged in. Beautiful technique. Oh, and she drops hard. She's looking at it. I don't think this is going to do it. I like the way you describe this match, Byron. It's one giant free-for-all. And while it's exciting to watch, it's absolute torture on these superstars. It is cold, and unfortunately, matches like this usually result in injury. Sometimes serious injury. Look out! The cover. One. Too close for comfort. The size of this girl's heart is simply immense. Buster! That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. The night could be over for Liv Morgan. Of course, Extreme Rules matches have resulted in some gruesome moments over the years, and perhaps none was more gruesome than in 2012 when Brock Lesnar busted John Cena open following a vicious attack. Bree's fangs are out, and they are sharp. As Byron mentioned, Lesnar's attack on Cena in 2012 was without question gruesome. And furthermore, I don't think I've ever seen John Cena manhandled like he was on that night. Yeah, Lesnar definitely brought it to Cena that night. But what's truly amazing... Amazing is that John Cena eventually found a way to win that match. She might have it. Oh, Brie Bella able to avoid damage. Look at this. She lets her out. She better have a good reason for this, Cole, because she just had her seconds away from tapping. I think. Liv Morgan. Thank <laughs> you. 
Just barely got out of the way. Oh, hanging on for dear life. Oh, how you power bomb. That might be it. Eight a pin attempt. Two. Too close for cover. Amazing. Oh, Brie Bella able to avoid damage. Now in full control. Look at her go. She's got her. Going for the big one. There it is, it's locked in. Smart maneuver. Now it's time to capitalize. She works her way out of that one. She's still got a bit of an uphill climb here though. Can't be stopped right now. It may look like this match is over right now, but let me assure you, climbing that ladder at this point is no easy task. When it comes to brutality, I would agree with Michael Cole's assessment that this match shares similarities with the 2016 Reign Styles match. Though for me, the biggest story of that night came after the match. And I agree with that for sure. Absolutely nobody thought they'd see Seth Rollins on that night, especially Roman Reigns. She's in control. She's in full control now. I don't believe it. And that table can shorten careers, Michael. I don't believe it. And that table can shorten careers, Michael. I'll tell you, watching Extreme Rules matches make me happy. My in-ring days are behind me. You talk about a treacherous environment to compete in. Look out, this is gonna be bad! Oh no, oh no! Oh, breakneck speed, what a hurricanrana. That might just be the final nail in the coffin. Oh, the yes lock is cinched in! Is he gonna yes lock? That's how you put an exclamation point on a match. This is a treacherous match indeed, as Corey was saying. I can't even tell you how many times you've seen Extreme Rules matches result in broken bones, stitches, and even... It's locked in. They tapped. They tapped. Man, that Extreme Rules match is one of the best I've ever seen. It was incredible. When any superstar, man or woman, is able to find a way to win a match, hanging an action filled as that one, they should be grateful and really proud. Some great stuff. This entire match was just one big highlight reel, and anything else. Here is your winner, and new Women's United States Champion. What's going on here? Incoming, when she gets in attack mode, look out. Going for it all here. Oof. Now, she just needs to finish her off. Brie Bella looking to end this. Yes, Lock! Brie's looking good here.
And Bree does a bit of trash talking. 